Vermont Avenue between 11th Street and West Adams is known as the El Salvador Corridor. Countless shops, restaurants, and markets populate the area, and foot traffic is non-stop. It's about as authentic as you can get without hopping on a plane. The area where you walk is like being in El Salvador. While it's the first designated Salvadoran neighborhood in the city, LA County is home to more than 400,000 Salvadorans, the second largest Hispanic population in Metro LA. It's a community on the cusp. We are just now coming into our own in terms of literature, but also journalism, home ownership, community building. Author Roberto Lovato writes extensively about LA Salvadoran community in his new book, Unforgetting. People have forgotten, and we ourselves have forgotten, who we are beyond the gangs. We are many things like any other human beings. We are hardworking. Salvadorans are known to be a very intense people in terms of work, in terms of their disposition to survive under any circumstances. That intensity is evident at the popular La Papusa Urban Eatery. Salvadoran comfort food is cooked to perfection and hospitality is served searing hot. We're in a little area in downtown LA in the Salvadoran corridor where people wouldn't think there'd be a place like this where everybody can feel welcome, not just my tia, but everybody. And their success is proof Salvadorans are survivors, unforgetting that is now the mission. I want to inspire other Salvadorans and Central Americans to tell their stories because we have great stories and we have something to say for a world that needs inspiring stories right now.